Get ready with me for my pap test. I recently found out that most cervical cancers are found in women who have never been screened or aren't screened as often as they should be. As a mom, I know I need to take care of my health to be there for my daughter. One way I can do that is to stay on top of my cervical cancer screenings. Did you know that regular on-time screenings with the pap test, HPV test, or both can actually help prevent cervical cancer or find it early when it's easier to treat? A pap test looks for cell changes on the cervix that can become cancer if they aren't treated, and the HPV test looks for the virus that causes these cell changes. If your pap test results are normal, your doctor may tell you that you can wait three years until your next pap test. If your results aren't normal, it doesn't mean you have cancer. Most abnormal results won't be cancer, but it's important to follow up with your doctor about your next steps. I know these tests can be uncomfortable. For me, seeing a healthcare provider I feel comfortable with helps. I can ask questions and talk about my concerns before the test. I'm also using this appointment as an opportunity to get back into a routine for my healthcare. The PAP and HPV tests only screen for cervical cancer, so I want to make sure I'm up to date with all of my screenings and regular checkups. Thanks for getting ready with me today. Now it's your turn to schedule that appointment and prioritize yourself. Make cervical cancer screenings part of your routine.